Hello Asylumists and welcome back to the Journey for the Dead God Achievement in the Binding of Isaac Repentance. I hope everybody's had a good day. And we're just going to hop right on in. Did I unlock any characters last time? I did not. So, another Isaac run. Uh, I don't know if anybody read the comments in the, or not the comments, the description for the last video, but October 9th, Alien Isolation will return. October 10th, I will start Totally Accurate Battle Simulator, and on, on October 11th, your old friend Jim will return. So I hope everybody's looking forward to that. We're going to try to keep this streak that I have going here on the way to the Dead God Achievement. Let's go into the treasure room. I forget what that item is. <coughs> oh! The reusable eternity. <coughs> and that'll give me a... Eternal heart. Every time I use it. So I can get essentially infinite health up if I don't accidentally die to Larry Jr. Larry Jr., everybody, the easiest boss that there is that I might die to because I'm trying to rush this. Alright, and we have... I was, yeah, I was I'm trying to remember which one the green one is. We'll pop that, and then we'll pop our eternal heart. And there's nothing left to see on this floor, so we'll move on. On to the basement part two. I have a key. We're going to immediately go to the treasure room. I am not grabbing. Just. Just to pick it up. Because I believe we have to pick up every item. I believe with every character as well. Uh, I'm not so sure on the with every character part. But. If that's the case then. This is already going to be a very very long journey. And we'll. Oh crap. There's a eternal fly there. I didn't even see. I'm not liking the layout of this room. Let's see if I can sneak on below. I do see a tinted rock, though. Oh. I'll take that spirit heart curse for him. And another tinted rock down here in the bottom left. Interesting. Great use of the pointer finger. I think tonight I'm going to record two two runs, two or three runs, and you'll all see them at different times tomorrow, starting at 8 at intervals of two hours apiece. Good old monster fight here.
I took a hit there. And that's monster down. Uh, this is a health up, right? HP and luck up. And then I'll pop that. And we'll have... I think we'll definitely be unlocking Magdalene. Pretty sure. Onto the caves part one. Bomb flies. No big deal. No big deal. Uh, if I'm not stupid about this anyway, I can probably not take any damage. It's becoming a bit clustered. Oh, yeah, one coming up behind me. Oh, that's two down. No, I accidentally went through the door at the top. Oh, I'm an idiot. I'm such a fucking idiot. <coughs> Oof. Got the coffees going on here. I'd like to try to get through this in a timely manner, but this room is going to take me some time. That much I know for sure. This room is going to take me some time. I'm getting stuck in these corners. Not good of me. Not good of me to take that stupid damage. I think this is the last one. Yeah. What is that? I've never seen that before. Pay to win. Now, I don't necessarily know what pay to win does, but I'm sure we'll find out as time progresses. Come on, pop up one more time. There we go. Key for the treasure room, if I can find it. Oh, bunch of fucking flies. That's one down, two down, three down, four down, and I took a half a heart a hit. A half heart hit. And that's the rest of them down. Did any item drop in this room? Let's see. No. There's the boss room, so the treasure room is on the other end of the map. That is good to know, good to know. I hope everybody's ready for spoopy season. I know me and my wife are. I'm gonna take another half a heart. Now let's traverse all the way back to the start of this level. I would waste my bomb on that, but I'm not going to. Oh, I don't like this room at all. Let's try to get through this room without taking a hit. Because that'd be a stupid hit if I took it. It's like, oh, you know what? Well, there goes that plan. Right out the window, right at the jump. And there goes I took another hit. I don't have the damage to be mowing through these rooms. I really don't now. Treasure room, treasure room. 
and the red skull poppy thingies. Uh, oh, what is that? That's, uh, the makeup? Mom's eyeshadow. Charm tears. I was close enough, close enough. I need to go through this top room and get more health, but it keeps giving me friggin' bomb flies. I do not like the bomb flies. You're charmed, not that it makes a difference. Are the mods still working? Or am I just tripping out? There was like three or four champion enemies in that room. And I don't know if they're capable of spawning on these early floors. Maybe I'm just tripping out. This is a new save file. Mods are disabled, as to, to my knowledge. But I've been wrong before. I'll probably be wrong again. I used my only bomb. I don't like these little worm doohickeys. Oh, I didn't know I could charm the boss. Just have you take care of all your wormy buddies for me. So I don't have to worry about it. And then we'll grab this. Grab the torn photo, because that's tears and shot speed up. What do we got in here? Uh, Eye of the Occult. We'll take Eye of the Occult. Oh, I'll pop that before I go. Just to make sure that I do and not to forget it. I don't know what character I should be trying to unlock first. I, by the looks of it, I could unlock Magdalene this run. But if I do a couple more devil deals, I could unlock, I believe, a Zazel. Get a bomb here. Oh, I do not like this room. I don't like this room. Don't like this room. Don't like this room. Can we charm some enemies, please? Let us charm the enemies. I'm going to take... Probably a lot of unnecessary hits this this room. Okay. Blue pill. First pill of the run. What is it? Balls of steel. Love to see it. You love to see it. Popped up right up my butthole. Alright. We got a key. We got to find the treasure room. Could it be down this way? Do these rooms even connect? They do. I have two bombs. I'll get this chest. Oh, maybe we can get Kane this run. Taking a lot of unnecessary damage. Yep, I keep walking into shit. If I can find a battery. I have an extra key. Get out of that danger room. Go down here one one at a time. Mm -hmm. 
Another big room here. Really globins. And no way to get to all the good stuff there. Uh, what we got? I like... I like Toxic Shock. And then I'll upgrade the store. Store upgrade level one. Love to see it. You love to see it. <coughs> Pardon me. Uh, fucking headset cords getting all over the place. I need to back up a bit. And actually see what I'm doing here. I can't get that coin. I have three hearts to beat whatever boss. Oh, wait, there's one more room. Hold up. Okay, then. Well, let's go see what boss it's going to give us. The Fallen. You know, it hasn't given us any of the horsemen that I unlocked, which is weird to a degree. I, uh, You know what? This... The Fallen might kick my ass. He really might kick my ass. Well, unless they turn on each other, and that gives me the opportunity to win. And I will pick that up. And then put it back down. Pop one of those and head to the next floor. We are doing pretty good. Doing pretty good. Uh, okay, next. A bomb beggar. I don't know if I'm going to use the bomb beggar at the moment. Do I... And then we have a treasure room with a Lil Haunt. Fear him. Fear him all the way. And then I... The Leapers. I don't like the fucking Leapers. Moving forward. I... Definitely don't like those guys. But our damage is now at a 5.19, so we're doing we're doing pretty well. Another pill, bad gas. Hate to see it. You hate to see it. Toxic shock is gonna carry me through the rest of this game. Watch I yeah I don't even have to oh I do have to do something because those guys were underground they weren't affected is that guy I thought he was charmed but it looked like he was more afraid I haven't seen a tinted rock in a while the butter bean has appeared in the basement I might be, yeah, I feel like I'm going to be unlocking Magdalene this run. Which I don't know how often I'll play as Magdalene, like, at the start. Obviously, I'm going to mix it up a lot, and I'm going for the Dead God achievement, so I have to kind of do everything that the game has to offer. Which means all the challenges, everything. Um, I'm looking forward to getting to that point. Oh my god. Took a bunch of my keys. I don't appreciate that. I can't pick up that heart. Um, what's in the shop? Greed. I was hoping that I could upgrade the store maybe one more time. I think it's 
I think at 40 it does something. I'm not, I don't remember. My knowledge is kind of limited. I'll take all the coins, though, and that nickel. I'll take that nickel. Get our money up. Maybe we'll unlock Kane. I probably could have unlocked Kane by now if I hadn't put the rest of that money into the donation box. We have at the least two rooms over here. Well, I didn't even get to see what was in that room. It died instantly. Toxic Shock will definitely carry through a lot of these extra rooms. Toxic Shock's not going to do a lot for the boss room, but it'll carry me through some of these rooms with relative ease. I wonder what boss is going to give us. I hope it's one of the horsemen. No, it's it's Monstro. It's Monstro too. I should have moved. Thank you, Lil Haunt. We got the job done. Blue Cap, HP up. We unlike Magdalene. And challenge number five, challenge number ten. Blue Cap, shot speed up. Love to see it. I'll pop another one of those and we'll head to the next floor. Oh, we immediately we have an arcade. What's in the arcade? I don't think there's anything I want to get from the arcade right this second. Yeah, Toxic Shock is doing a lot of work for me. It did not kill the Globins, though. What's this card? The High Priestess. Mother's watching. Okay, so that's Mom's Foot Stomp, I believe. I will probably use that on the boss. More than likely, I'll use it on the boss. I know those of you that watch me probably shit all over how I play this game. But, you know... We're here for a good time. Two bombs. Treasure room. Another bomb. Fill up my hearts. What do we got? The Book of Shadows. Temporary invincibility. And then I could reset it. For sticky bombs. Egg sack bombs. And then we'll continue down through the floors. We'll see where life takes us. Alright, there's nothing for us there, really. I'll take that key. Some globins. And I hope this is actually it is. Give me that sack. I'll pop that. And then boom. Uh, and the rest can go into the donation machine. Unless it breaks. It might break. Yeah, it broke. Um, I'll save the five coins. Maybe I can unlock Kane by the end of this. Probably not, but we'll see. We will see. We shall see. <coughs> Let's just go get to the boss. I unlocked the horseman, and I have yet to fight the horseman. I find it very weird. I'll take that bomb. Oh, the mom fight already.
This is going to be a long, a longer mom fight. Because I'm not really doing the damage that I'd like to be doing. Which is a lot of damage. I'd like to be doing a lot of damage. Or at the very least, consistent damage. That was stupid of me. Oh, I wasn't paying attention to the foot. I think we've, yeah, okay. And HP up, which should, yeah, okay. Let's move on to the womb. Or the utero, utero one. Spiders in the utero. Got it. Uh, what the? I've never seen those before in my life. Can I check my stats in game? No. I can't go see what I've unlocked. I feel like the utero is not... I feel like you have to unlock that. I feel like my mods might have fucked up a lot of shit. Either that or I'm just very paranoid about the fact that my mods may or may not have fucked up a lot of my shit. Oh, a lockdown. Thank you. You love to see it. You know, I have 24 bombs. Ow. Uh, I could go get that key, but I really don't care to. Um, let's go this way, I suppose. Take care of those. What's this? The magician, may you never miss your goal. A uh, Gertie. And this might be the end of my run. I'm going to go ahead and pop that so I never... I don't think it works with what I'm using. Oh, it, you know, it would help if I'd actually hit the item that I was trying to hit. We unlock that and unlock that and all that health. Alright, we're back in. I honestly didn't think I was going to sneak through that little gap, but let's see what this dude gives us. I'm running out of coins, my guy. Give me something good. That bum friend, he's greedy. Great. Ow. Ow. Fuck, I was trying not to hit that that whole time. I don't care to grab another bomb. Oh, I almost ran straight into that. That would have been very bad. Oh, half a Loki. Got it. Unlocked Loki's horns. Bro, is these just all bosses in these rooms? Or wait, was that... That wasn't Dingle, I don't think. Oh, I don't like that. 
I did not like that at all. I'm losing health. It's in this room. Oh, well, this may be it. There's no way I beat whatever this boss is with half a heart. It, actually, you know what? I might. <laughs> I might. It's the... Oh, I don't. All right, well, I hope everybody enjoyed watching. If you did, uh, leave a like and subscribe, and I'll catch you with some more Binding of Isaac Repentance on the journey to the Dead God Achievement in a couple hours. I'll see you then.